Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for joining me for today's very awaited pre-fall home decor haul. I am so excited beyond words to share with you guys these items. I know a lot of people don't like jumping seasons, but I like thinking ahead of time so I can purchase these pieces little by little and be ready for that season when it comes. Like I said, these are pre-fall items, so they're just transitional items that are gonna work throughout these months where it's not really summer, but it's not really fall yet. Yet, but you kind of just want to cozy up your space at least that is what I'm gonna do I did this last year and it's something I really enjoy doing you guys know I get tired or bored of my decor and I like decorating several times a year so that is what I'm gonna do and then of course later on throughout the weeks I will start incorporating a little bit more fall once that starts getting closer but for my pre-fall look or vision I just wanted to warm up my space I want to remain pretty neutral because I told you guys in my last video I'm actually enjoying the neutral aspect of my home right now but I really want to warm it up with some more browns and tans and so on and just some more of those like rustic fall colors without having to add any fall specific decor items quite yet so that is the items i'm going to show you guys today hopefully this inspires you to go out and get some of the same items some of which are on clearance right now so definitely if you like anything i will try to link as much as i can down below in the description box i know some of these items are also on clearance online so hopefully if you like them you get a chance to pick them up but without further ado, make sure you stick around till the end because I will be announcing the second giveaway winner for the $25 gift card. If you missed last week's first winner, the winner was Kathy Cunningham. If you didn't see that video, definitely just leave me a comment as to how I can best get a hold of you. But yeah, stick around till the end of this video to hear more about the second giveaway winner and we are well on our way to the third one. I almost can't believe how fast it's happening. We are almost at 9,750. Again, the goal being 10,000, so I'm just mind blown. But anyways, as always, if you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe if you are new and let's go ahead and get started with I think I'm gonna show you guys the one and only item I have picked up at Michaels so far so Michaels has some good like pre-fall um, home decor they have two main themes right now at least when I went they had a sunflower theme and then they had like a southwestern decor theme which is my favorite if you guys don't know I am from New Mexico so I'm very familiar with the decor pieces that are in that theme I've seen a few videos of people being disappointed about it or not getting it or understanding it but again since I'm in New Mexico a lot of those pieces are very popular like home decor items here where I live but anyways the first piece I picked up is just this beautiful little vase this is actually a ceramic vase and it just looks like wood I think this is so cute and I didn't think the price was really like bad it was not on sale yet it was $11.99 but I did use a 20% coupon and I picked it up just because I know Michaels usually doesn't have the stuff I really like when the sale comes around. So that is why I went ahead and I picked it up. I do want the taller one, but I figured I can wait for the sale for that one. But if I don't get my hands on it, at least I have the little one. But that is it for Michaels. And then moving on to Hobby Lobby, of course I had to get a more of a fall scented candle without it being a pumpkin scented candle, if that makes sense. So Hobby Lobby has this like brand of candles. I just really love the container and the presentation of it, I guess. I just think it looks so uh, rustic, kind of vintagey looking. And this is in hazelnut latte hazelnut latte this was $13.99 and this smells so good it smells so warm so delightful kind of a dessert and like coffee which obviously you guys know I love this was $13.99 I got it 50% off and I just think 
It's such a good transitional candle. I'm really hoping this doesn't give me a headache because I don't believe this is like a soy candle. You guys know I've been trying to stick to soy candles, but hopefully this doesn't give me a headache. If it does, it works as a good decor piece. So anyways, but I really hope I could light it because it smells so good. And then next up, I got this really cute amber glass vase. You guys know amber glass was so popular last year for fall decor. And it was kind of hard to get a hold of because it was mainly popular, but like at you know target with hearth in hand but those things sell out really fast and then they kind of sold out online so it was just it was popular but it wasn't very searchable if that makes sense so i don't remember hobby lobby having as much amber glass as they do this year so they had this one as well as one that's a little bit wider but still like stubby like this one and this was pretty expensive i want to say it was like $17.99 I could be wrong because this actually didn't have a price tag and when the girl went to go look for it she actually just pulled up the the iPad and she gave it to me for $14.99 which I know it was not $14.99 like I'm almost 100% sure but of course it was 50% off so I got it for around $8 again I still think that's pretty expensive but I really liked it and I figure it's gonna look really good with my other amber glass pieces so just went ahead and got it definitely recommend heading to Hobby Lobby if you're looking for some amber glass pieces I do think it's gonna be really popular this year again given last year was kind of the first year it came into like the trends or whatnot but next item are just these simple candlestick holders or sconces. I think that is what they're actually called. And I got these to go on either side of my TV up here behind me, if you guys can see that. And then you just put a nice little tapered candle. I think that's going to add such a cozy look to my TV and fireplace area. And I don't know. I just thought they were really cute. I got them in this black color. I'm going to use like black and gold for my metals for fall and for pre-fall. So I'm really excited about that. And these were super inexpensive. I was looking at some from World Market that were I think 25 a piece and these were only $7.99 and 50% off so I got two of these for $8 whereas I was thinking of purchasing them at world market for 50 so definitely such a good deal and the last pieces I got from Hobby Lobby are just some florals I got all of these let me show you guys real quick but my go-to florals for pre-fall and fall are florals that look dead or dried or just kind of towards the end of the summer season is the look I try to go for so Hobby Lobby has amazing preserved florals for super inexpensive if you get them during the 50% off sale like for example these ones were $9.99 so I got them for $5 and they just look like dried up flowers which I really really love I love these so much I think they're just so beautiful I hope you guys can kind of see them if I do that but I love these and then I got some, I believe these are baby's breaths and these were only $10.99 as well, so about $5. And again, they just look so pretty. I love the warmth of the colors of them and I just think they add that coziness to a space, especially if you are like me and you have a white house. My walls are white, a lot of my furniture is white and I'm just not a fan of white on white on white on white on white. That's just my personal preference. I like, you know, white is a good clean slate, but I like to add my touch with colors and creams and so on. So I thought that this would be perfect and it kind of stands out from the white, like I said. And then next up, I got these. These were less expensive. These were only $7.99. Again, I got them for like $4 after the sale. And these are just... I don't know what they're even called these are I don't know it doesn't say what they are but they're super cute and they're just such a good floral and the last ones again were $7.99 and these are more of a white color just to blend in some of that white like I said and yeah they're super cute and not very expensive so 
that is it for Hobby Lobby and that one thing for Michaels. Now let's go ahead and move on to Target. And then at the end, I want to show you guys the rug. You guys know that I was telling you guys about getting a new rug and it got here. So I haven't even set it up or anything. So we'll do that in just a minute. But the first item I got was this a beautiful throw blanket. I love this so much. I think again, that color, that warmth, I just think it's going to look so good on like my creamier couch and just add so much warmth which is what i'm going for this is from the new fall collection um threshold with studio mcgee they started releasing a few like sneak peeks into the store and as soon as i saw this one i knew i had to get it because again i just don't want to risk things selling out especially when it's something that i know i really want and love and yeah i just went ahead and i purchased it if you guys have not seen the sneak peek they put up online you guys definitely need to go and look at it heart your favorite items and get ready for the release because I believe they release on the 11th so this Sunday I want to say and I am so ready I already have a few items like hearted because I know I want them and I'm not even going to risk trying to find them at the store at this point I'm just going to order them but this was $30 and it's going to look so perfect with this pillow right here that I picked up this is just like a lumber pillow this is what it looks like what really got me with this one is the little touch of gold it has on the zipper and the little touch of like leather that it has because I'm gonna keep my leather like touches but some of the new pieces from that collection just look so good with leather like i am just so excited i am so ready you guys i am pumped for this season for this pre-fall and fall season you guys have no idea definitely hit that subscribe button and stick around but this was a 22 dollars and i do love that the cover removes so you can wash it and so on but what i really liked about this color is it's gonna go so good with my like rust color that i had last year and i just think it's gonna it's just gonna look so cozy and i'm so excited anyways the next item i got is this I want to say it's a magazine holder it's this like leather magazine holder it has the gold detail right here and i love this ever since it came out in the summer but when it came out it was like 45 dollars yeah it was 45 and i just didn't have a use for it because i just couldn't envision it in my summer decor but when i saw that it was on sale for 33 i want to say i knew i had to get it because this is going to be perfect for fall i'm thinking of like either placing it next to my fireplace with some logs in there or a blanket hanging over or just something to make it look super cozy and i'm just really excited you guys know i love that leather accent which is going to be prevalent throughout my decor this season so so excited i got that and the last piece i got is pretty big so i don't think i'm even going to be able to show you guys but oops backwards it is this lamp right here it's this floor lamp this is also threshold by studio or studio mcgee by threshold or something like that and you guys know that i had been eyeing this for my bedroom i loved it so much it is actually what inspired the lamp i ended up getting for my bedroom makeover which is coming finally we finally are getting the tile it should be um, it should be here this week and then Jonathan is taking a few days off to get started on that So hopefully hopefully that video is here soon But anyways, you guys know that in the video where I shared what I got for the bedroom I talked about this lamp and I really loved it. It was priced at $70, which is why I didn't get it But it went on clearance for $35, which I was like I need to get it i mean i need to it's such a good deal the one i got for my bedroom was 27 something plus tax it was like 30 dollars so i'm so happy i got this for 35 dollars this is gonna go in my living room in one of these corners so i'm so excited and the last piece obviously is the rug so let's go ahead and get to putting that out i hope i hope it looks good oh my love 
You're such a fragile thing, I know. And with the winter comes the ice, the snow. I'll be right back. Let me go ahead and set it up and struggle by myself without you guys listening to me. I'll be right back. Okay, friends. So this is what it looks like. I obviously have to play around with the layouts or the arrangement. Um, for now, I'm not exactly sure how I want it. Or I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I pull it out all the way to the corner of this couch and just kind of have that front leg sitting on it or do you think this looks okay so let me kind of show you I'm sorry about my mess but you know I wasn't planning on cleaning today so this is what it looks like let me show you from this angle ah. okay so this is what it looks like from this angle so do you guys think the placement is okay right there or should I move it? I think this size is going to work. I don't think I need a bigger one. I, I do like how it looks and I'm so excited about it. So this is Studio McGee as well and I did not get it for the price that it is. Yeah, so it's Threshold Studio McGee. So this rug, I believe this size was 300 and I actually got it for over 60% off. So I got it for about $140 and I love how it looks. Let me put the coffee table here and let's and let me show you what that looks like. Okay friends, I love this so much. I am so happy how cozy and warm this space already feels. I'm so excited. Oh my god. I think the colors are going to work so good with what i'm doing for pre-fall i think the pattern is so simple yet it adds such an amazing point of interest and i just really love this now there's some contrast between the wood on the table and the wood of my tile floors and i just think this looks so good i'm almost tempted to get another one for underneath the table but i'm gonna wait a little bit more let this one sit on me and I'm, I'm, I'm so happy. I'm beyond words right now. Okay, everyone. Well, definitely let me know what you guys think down below. Are you guys excited for this pre-fall season, for fall coming up? I am so, so happy. And I am telling you guys, God knows when he does things. Because if you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys know that my grandma just recently passed away last week. And... This season in general is hard because my dad, two year anniversary of his passing is also coming up and it can be a sad season. It can be definitely really sad, but I'm so happy that God has given me something to be happy about during this season that really like takes my head out of the sadness and allows me to focus on something else that brings happiness to me that brings joy and you guys just have no idea how much I've reflected on that 
throughout the past few days, especially since my grandma's passing. For all of you guys who messaged me, thank you guys so much. I haven't really gotten back to messages because I have just been spending time with my family and just, you know, taking time to breathe. So I haven't really gotten back to anyone. But thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. I'm so excited. I hope you guys are excited for this season as well. I'm also very excited for 10,000 so, so soon. But that brings me to this week's winner. We did go ahead and cross the 9,500 mark. And the winner of this gift card is Consider It All Joy. I will pop up her comment right here. And thank you everyone else for your support. It really means the world to me honestly it just uh, it just means everything for consider it all joy if you can just leave me the best way to get a hold of you down in the comments and again just make sure you comment on every video because i will just be going to the most recent one and picking a random comment for the winner and yes that is everything for today's video i hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day and i will see you guys in my next one please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up to help the youtube algorithm and subscribe if you have not yet i would really appreciate it but as always i hope you guys have an amazing day i will see you guys in my next one bye you know my love.